Welcome back. The Lexington Rescue Mission has a new way to support artists and help our citizens re-enter the workforce. And today we're pleased to welcome Laura Connell, the Communications and Development Director from Lexington Rescue Mission. Thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you for having me. Well, tell us a little bit about, for um, folks who may not be familiar with this, uh, mm -hmm. what the Lexington Rescue Mission is and what it does. Sure. We are, this is our 10th year in Lexington and we work with the poor and homeless in Lexington. What we do is we try and help people um, get off the streets and be become self-sufficient and we do that through a lot of different things. We have things where we try and meet basic needs by providing public meals and clothing and medical care to people who don't have insurance. But then we also do life skills classes. We help people who don't have work find jobs and then we also um, provide homeless prevention services for people who might need some help with rent or utilities to keep them from becoming homeless in the first place. And there's a, a new project that not uh, that not only helps uh, continue the mission of uh, Lexington Rescue Mission, but can also help some artists. Tell us about that. Yeah, we're really excited. Um, we are getting ready to have a grand opening for our bazaar and gathering place. And it's at our thrift store, which is on Bryan Avenue, uh, where North Limestone and Loudoun intersect Bryan. And what that is, it's a European consignment boutique where we have local artists who are selling their uh, goods and their art and people can come and shop and the part of the proceeds go to support the local artists and then part of the proceeds come back to support the mission and so it's a great opportunity for people who want to build up um, maybe their own business they can get started with that at our place and then it also provides bridge employment for people who are working in our employment services trying to find more permanent employment uh, while they are in the midst of their job search they work with us and so we're able to help um, provide them with some extra income and keep them from um, becoming homeless and that great job experience that uh, they can, can take to translate into maybe continued employment as well, right? Exactly. We work really closely with them to find out what areas they might need help in uh, on the job. And then also um, it can provide some good references when they get done. Um, they might not have um, the best work history. And so this is a great way for them to get back on their feet. And a uh, big event to kick things off. Tell mm -hmm. us uh, what's in store for the opening. Yeah, we're, we're really excited. Um, Saturday is our grand opening. And uh, the doors will open at 10, but the event starts at 1. And um, at 1 o'clock, the uh, Lexington Fashion League is going to have a fashion show. They've taken clothes from our thrift store and bazaar and have um, uh, changed them in, in order to make uh, make really cool and unique outfits and so they're going to be showing those off at one o'clock and then at two o'clock we have a band that's going to be playing uh, Palisades and then three o'clock uh, Warren Byram which is another band and then at four we have um, Oh My Me which is a third band so it's going to be a great time of music and we're going to have free food and, and drinks and um, just a great opportunity for people to come and shop around and see if they can find something they like. And you've been seeing some of the photos uh, you know you mentioned artists but it's uh, mm -hmm. it's not just uh, paintings or that kind of mm -hmm. Art. Some of it uh, is, uh, we saw chairs mm -hmm. and I think wallets even, so all yeah. kinds of goods. Yeah, we've got um, quilts and we've got chairs that are made out of belts and we have um, so like homemade soaps and um, t-shirts and all kinds of things uh, there. Um, we have a lady that makes um, notebooks and journals out of um, upcycled materials and so there's there's all kinds of things jewelry it's a great opportunity to come you never know it's a great place to buy gifts for people right so. and you're supporting a, a great cause and uh, continuing to uh, improve uh, the experience for citizens right here in our community great, yes. great well, uh, learning about it well we're excited about it and we just hope that people come out on Saturday and join us it'll be a, a great opportunity to support the mission and uh, local artists well, if you're interested in learning more, you see the phone number as well as website and an email address if you're interested in getting more details. Thanks for being with us. Thank you. We'll be right back with more news after this.